From the MVG Production Studios, this is Video Game Jeopardy! Now we're to the studio of today's contestants. A student from Palm Bay, Florida, Chris Verhaman. A YouTuber from Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada, Justin Noyes. And a returning champion, a volunteer worker from Sacramento, California, Corey Lawrence, who's one day cash winnings total $6,000. And now, here's your host, the star of Video Game Jeopardy, Andrew St. Clair! John, welcome back to Video Game Jeopardy. On our last episode, we crowned a brand new champion, Corey Lawrence. Oh. Who won $1,000. Corey, welcome back. Thank you. Uh, how, how do you feel that, you, how do you feel that you've um, earned your belt? It was rough, but... You know, let's hope uh, things uh, turn a little bit better. Indeed, if we, uh, for those of you who remember, who didn't see it in the uh, on our last episode, the final Jeopardy, I know Jeopardy category was Starcade. Um, Mr. Mr. Lawrence beat Mr. Justin R Mr. Mr. by only six hundred dollars. So that was a close game. So we'll, we'll see how well Corey does this game. Corey, good luck. Thank you. Welcome back to contestants who have played in previous video game Jeopardy, Mr. Justin Noyes and Mr. Chris Rahaman. Gentlemen, Hello. welcome back. Hello. Thanks. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, Mr. Andrew St. Clair. Thank you. Well, you, 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 know you all know how to play this game. Mm-hmm. Just remember, please wait until I complete the PR thing before you buzz in. And you remember, you must have at least one dollar found Jeopardy. Okay. So, and, uh, with all that said, let's hit. Let's go. Let's start. Let's begin round one. Brandon, hit the board. <laughs> Bios between two hundred and one thousand dollars. Here are the categories for the Jeopardy round. They are three sixty plots, which came last. The Bueller. 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 I will, you're, 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 I'm, I'm, you're gonna have to change one word. You change the Bueller to sub to the actual response. And finally, emails. Huh. Yeah, I'm going to name the, the character you, you name the series or the video game. Depending champion, you have control. Please choose a category and an amount. Let's go with Pac-Man for 200. Yes. A Pac Man came out to the arcade. What well, is 1980? Correct. Hi, Justin. Pac Man for 400. Video game, which came out in 2016, that originally came out for iOS and Android. Features the famous screen runs out of memory. What is Pac Man 256? <laughs> Justin, go ahead, please. Pac Man for 600. The person who was the first person to be Pac Man. Before he admitted he cheated on another game in a 2018 documentary. 
Justin. Who is Billy Mitchell? Correct. And of course, the one, the one he cheated was the King of Kong. But good, good, good documentary on uh, G4 and something like that. Yeah, go, go, go ahead, Justin. Like men for 800. Okay. Want to play Miss Pac-Man not on a machine, but on an app? You can with this app. What is that? Oh, man. Try to buzz Anyone? it. But, but, Corey. What is RetroPie? No. I'm looking for an app, Corey. That is an app. Justin or, Justin or Chris? I it's not coming to my head. So. Correct response. What is Google Maps? What? Google. 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 Uh, Google Maps. Yeah. Are true. You <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm not kidding. It's true. You, ch you ch check it out. Google Maps uh, and Ms. Pac-Man. True story. Go ahead, Justin. You, you got, you got the last, you got the last trick runs. Go ahead. Pac-Man, one thousand dollars. Okay. <laughs> Read the cat. Gory. The first Pac-Man game that was both Pac-Man and pinball. Ooh. Anyone? Mm, yep. Yeah. The correct response, what is Baby Pac-Man? Baby Pac-Man. Uh, 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 here, 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 here's the interesting thing I might found this out here. This is true. Uh, <laughs> you guys have might heard the, the, the world's largest Pac-Man. Uh, it, it, it's true. It has a 108-inch LED display, and 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 its and its cost is just under 11 grand per per unit. I've seen I've seen one of those things. It is really really big. Trust me, Justin. You have you 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 have you still have control. Choose another category in amount, please. Which came last? 200. Okay, going to that category. Nintendo Switch. Super Mario Odyssey, Sonic Forces, Splatoon 2. Oh, damn it. Corey. What is Sonic Forces? Correct. Go ahead, Corey. Continue that for 400. Okay. Xbox, Need for Speed Carbon, Over the Hedge, Spy Hunter, Nowhere to Run. Ooh. Anyone? No guess. I, I don't want a chance to. Right response, what is Need for Speed Carbon? Damn it, I was going to say that, I just don't know why I hesitated. Go ahead, Corey. Video game mails for 200. Okay, switch to the category, video game mails. Okay. I'm in, a, I'm in the character, you name the video game series. Dr. Robotnik. Mm, Justin. Well, they Sonic the Hedgehog. Yep. Of course, Dr. we also know as Dr. Eggman, but this robot did both the same. Go ahead, Justin. Billy Game Mail's four hundred dollars. Okay. Bang and Kano. Justin. What well, is Mortal Kombat? Correct. Mortal Kombat. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> go, go, go ahead, Justin. Six hundred Billy Game Mail's. Okay. Trevor Phillips. Uh, Corey. Grant that's out of five. What is Grant that's out of five? Excuse me. Correct. You, you, you are now out of the hole, Corey. Go ahead. Uh, continue that for eight. <laughs> okay. Pyramid Head. Mm. Mm. Okay. 
I had a feeling it might have been one of the uh, Resident Evil games, but I wasn't going to chance it. No, 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 it's not. It's Greg Spines was well, Silent Hill. Silent Hill, okay. I, I, I love that. It, pyramid Head. Funny name. Go ahead, Corey. Close it now. Answer. <laughs> okay. The hand is apple. Corey, you have nothing. You can be you can miss up to 1,000. How much you want to wager? Let's go with the uh, the uh, spot minimum, which is a thousand. Ma ma max oh, max you should say okay for thousand yeah. dollars in the game and category video game males. Here's your daily double. Leon S. Kennedy. What is Resident Evil Horror? Judge. <laughs> Correct. I was looking specifically for Resident Evil. And he first started much. in Resident Evil. He, uh, he first started in Resident Evil 2. That concludes the video game males category. Corey, you have thousand dollars. You're in second place. Go, go ahead and choose another category in amount, please. Let's go. Sports two. Okay, sports for two hundred. Mm -hmm. This classic video game was the same game when people bought the Nintendo Entertainment System. It requires the zapper. Justin. Well, this duck hunt. Correct. <laughs> Go I ahead, have, Justin. I have that game, actually. I, I, I did too. It's a classic. Go ahead, Justin. Sports for four. Okay. The light plane, skydiving, rocket belt, and hang gliding are the four events in this video game that had a sequel for the Nintendo 64. Oh. Oh. Justin? Well, it's pilot wings. Correct. You're doing good. Go, go, go ahead, Justin. Sports for six. All right. <laughs> Spanning the globe, the being the constant for the sport. It's the emphasis for this video game where you might hear, Down goes Frasia! Down goes Frasia! Ow. <laughs> Anyone? Corey? There we go. Thank right. you. What Corey? is. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Respond. Uh, what is, uh, what is, uh, Fight Night? No! No. Uh, Justin or Chris? No. I don't think Great response. What is ABC Wide World of Sports Boxing? I've never heard of that. It's going to be the kind of variety of sports. Know. Jim McKay said, of course... Know. <laughs> Justin, you have you had the last correct response. Go ahead. Sports. Uh, okay. Game. You are playing two on two for a total of twelve minutes, including halftime. Whether you be on fire or hit a crushing dunk that shares the backboard. Ah, damn it. Corey. What is NHL hockey? No. No! No way. Justin! What is NBA Jam? Yes, yes, yes. One sport, uh, Corey. Uh, I, 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 don't, I don't think you can, a, you can, shoot, you can shoot a backboard in hockey. <laughs> uh, there is no backboard in hockey. Whatever. Go ahead, uh, Justin. Finish him. Okay. For a thousand. Uh, okay. For a thousand dollars of sports. Whether it be the T Birds, Hot Flash, the Rockers, or three bad teams, you will rock on this game on wheels. Beep. 
Justin. Oh, Rocket League? No. Corey or Chris? Not chance again. Correct response. What is roller games? Roller games. Which was both which is both arcade and also on Nintendo. The arcade version is much popular, I think, than the other. <laughs> that goes that category. Justin, choose a category, another category to map, please. Is that Bueller? Two hundred. <laughs> okay, going to change that Bueller. I'm gonna name Bueller. the system. Uh, you you need, you change you have to change one word to complete the tile for two hundred. PS4, February 9th, 2016. <laughs> Lovers in a dangerous Bueller. Yeah, Lord help us. <laughs> Anyone? No, I don't know. No. <laughs> what is space time? Space time. Oh, okay. Never heard of that. Go ahead, Justin. <laughs> Let's do another fight one. Take the Mueller. <laughs> Just stop. Just stop. <laughs> All right. For 400. <laughs> Daniel Wee, YJ 2011. The one million. The one million dollar. Mueller. <laughs> ah, damn it. I was right. Chris. <laughs> what is the pyramid? Correct. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right, Chris. Yeah, for, go ahead, Chris. <laughs> I'd be a fool. I'd be a fool if I didn't get that. Um, <laughs> change the pill. What the heck? Change the pill. Like oh, wait, 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 what? Change the pill or six hundred. Okay. Cube, October 17th, 2005. <laughs> Fire Emblem. <laughs> Absolutely not. No. <laughs> Fire Emblem, Panda Bueller. <laughs> Corey. What is radiance? Correct. You're out of the hole again. Go ahead, Corey. <laughs> Change to be a blur for eight. <laughs> I, 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 I gotta stop laughing here. Eight hundred. Oh, All right. The, the, oh, the, the, the Simpson play one. The Simpson. Bart Simpson. The Bueller. I'm not gonna. Do it. <laughs> Justin. What is the Simpsons? Bart versus the Space Mutants. <laughs> Wrong! <laughs> I thought so. <laughs> I'm not Corey it. Chris. Not chasing it. Uh, no. Uh, Barbara Speedman came out earlier. Great response was Bart versus the world. No! Really? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll Go try. ahead, uh, <laughs> Corey. I think Corey last one. Yeah, Corey. Go ahead, Corey. <laughs> Let's close it out. Thank you. <laughs> God. Sega Saturn, 1995. <laughs> Bueller. Loaded. 86. <laughs> Double header. No. Justin. Well, this is loaded. 96. Double header. Correct. Yeah. And that and that and that completes the change of Bueller. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. Get it to that. Jeez. And, and I, I, def, I definitely want that in, in the uh, post presentation of Bueller. <laughs> Bueller. 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 Uh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, that, uh, okay, simmer down. Let, let's kind of take, take a deep breath. <sighs> Justin, you, 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 Justin, go ahead. Oh my god, that was way too funny of a category. <laughs> All right, where's Kim last for 600? Oh, voice crack. All right. Wait, wait, maybe it's another Bueller, but there isn't one. For 600. 
PlayStation 1, <coughs> Rampage 2, Universal Tour, Quick 2, Resident Evil 2. And what's this about? Which game last? Oh, which game was last? Out of time, never mind. Out of time. Quick response. What is quick to? Well, what do I wrong? So. Go, go ahead, Justin. This came last 800. Okay. Sega Dreamcast, Atari Anniversary Collection, Bumperman Online, Crazy Taxi 2, Beyblade's Greatest Hits, Volume 2. Anyone? Nope. Doing it. response, what is Midway's Greatest Hits, Volume 2? Oh. I was gonna go with go, that. Sure. Go, go ahead, Justin. Close out which came last. Okay. Nintendo 64, Lonely Runner 3D, Microsoft Machine 64 Turbo, All Star Baseball 2000, Triple Play 2000. Ooh. Corey. What is Micro Machine 64 Turbo? No. Uh, Justin or Chris? Not chancing it. Craig Spots, what is All Star Baseball 2000? Damn it. Uh, I don't know why I should. Uh, that, 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 that category. We have one category left. It's all about Xbox 660 Plus. Where are we going to start, Justin? Xbox 660 Plus 200. All right. Bartender Desmond Miles is kidnapped and forced to participate in a series of trials translating the genetic memories of his ancestors into a simulated reality. <coughs> Anyone? Uh, I'm reading it. It's not... Corey. What is Assassin's Creed? Correct. Okay, Corey. Uh, 400, please, sir. Okay. The story is set in the year 2508 and begins when the USG Ishimura sends out a distress signal during a mining operation on the planet Aegis 7. Anyone? <laughs> Correct response. What is Dead Space? Go ahead, Corey. Six. Okay. Uncle Scrooge rescues Huey, Dewey, and Louie from Big Time Beagle when he finds a painting that has the hidden location of five treasures that he sets out to find in this game. Oh, what is that? Oh. Justin. What is DuckTales? Judge. <laughs> DuckTales Remastered is, is actually, is, is, yeah, it was DuckTales, of course, and yes, DuckTales Remastered is what I was looking for specifically. That's correct. You, you, go ahead, Justin. Eight. Okay. A series of earthquakes threatens to undo all the recovery efforts in Wasteland. The Mad Doctor arrives and asks Oswald to join forces with him in this sequel. Hmm. Anyone? No. <laughs> Crime response, what is Epic Mickey 2, The Power of Two? And to complete the and to complete the board for Xbox 360 plus for 1,000. In 2613, the world is ruled by an empire known as the Commonwealth. 
under the reign of Tiberius. Their Berean nation's resistance forces began to rise across the land. Correct response was hardcore uprising. Well, that concludes the Deputy round. Let's take a look at the scores here. We have Justin Lee with 3,000. Chris is in second place with 400. Corey is in third with minus 600. Okay. Let, all right, guys. You, you guys have to take a breather here. We're going to talk to you all here for just a moment here. Chris, si since last time you played uh, you played video game Jeopardy, has there been a different, a different game that's become your favorite? Well, I, I mean, considering I have something to go knowledge of video games, I say something in the middle. I'll put it in the middle, wise. But it's a good game uh, either, either way. <laughs> I see. I, I see. And, and, why, and why is it a good game? Well, it's a test your test your video game knowledge. Quite mm -hmm. as simple as that. Just like this one. Okay, Chris. All right, Justin Noise. Uh, same same question. Well, I have actually two favorite games that I played all the time. They are for this one for the Switch and one for my 3DS. Yeah, Super Mario Odyssey and Pokemon Ultra Moon. Okay, and why is that your favorite? Well, I like playing both Mario and Pokemon games. All right. Uh, and are, are, are you enjoying them? Yeah, I did beat Super Mario Odyssey. That is really a fun game. Indeed, and, and, and it is. Well, Justin, good, good, good to have you here. Finally, our Corey Lawrence here. Corey, uh, you, 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 you were in this position actually in our last game, remember right? And you, you went ahead. Well, and double, you, you took over here in double jeopardy, or we'll say you're doing that. Uh, yep. uh, uh, how, how, how you feeling? Uh, being the defending champion here. Hey, anything can happen, you know. So, if it happens, right. it can happen again. That's right. We've only, we've only only one time have we actually had a person win two games before, and that was Mr. Eric Lima who won both both game one and two. Okay, here we're gonna, uh, at this point we're gonna, we're gonna take a commercial break here for you guys to take your breather, breather, and we'll be right back with Double Jeopardy right after this. Welcome back, everybody. Our defending champion, Corey Lawrence, right now is in third place. But double jeopardy, anything can happen because we're going to have two daily doubles. And the, and the value is going to be dollars. And here are the categories for the double jeopardy round. They are... Time travel... Best reviewed Wii U games according to Metacritic. Next. Cats and Dogs. Next. Sixth generation video games. Next. In our uh, Mr. Brandon Scruggs, MVG Productions, where all, all the responses will begin with the letter M. And finally, Interactive games. Corey, you are, you are, you are in third place, as I mentioned here. So choose a category and an amount, please. Let's go with Time Travel 4. Okay. Jumpin' Gigawatts! You're Marty McFly. 
trapped 30 years before where he should be. He needs to fix the time before he vanishes out of existence. Damn it. Justin. What is back to the future? Correct. Yeah. Go ahead, Justin. Let's do a little MVG Productions for 400. Oh, Lord. Okay. Going to that category. Remember, all of them are and begin with the letter M. In this classic NES game, you are the blue bomber facing off against a new enemy called, named Dr. Cossack. Mm -hmm. Damn it. Justin. What is Mega Man? More specific. Uh, is... Time. Ah, come on. Corey, Corey, Chris. Corey, Corey? What is Mega Man 1? No. Chris? No way, not chance again. Correct response, what is Mega Man 4? <laughs> Mega Man 1, 2, and 3 was Dr. Wiley. In the beginning, it was Dr. Cox from Mega Man 4, and then Wiley came in. That's why that's the response here. Justin? Go ahead. MVG for 800. Okay. This action and stealth game, the player takes the role of Corporal Sergeant Frank Keegan, a member of the 82nd and 17th Airborne Divisions fighting the Axis forces. There Corey. we go. Was Medal of Honor. Judge. Medal of Honor Vanguard specifically, but that, but I, but Judge accepts it. That's correct. Go ahead, Corey. Don't know why the hell is it, things drop in responses when I keep uh, rapping on it like that. Uh, Twelve hundred, please. Okay. In this game, players take on the role of either Agent K or Agent J, trying to stop aliens from blowing up the Earth with a Class 7 ozone demographifier. Come on. There we go. I got it. Corey? What is meant in black? Judge. More specifically, please. What is meant in black 2 alien attack? Judge. Man Black, I believe it's looking for Man in Black 2, Alien Escape, but it's close enough. Man Black, Man in Black 2, that's correct. You're now out of the hole, Corey. You're at 600. Go ahead. Continue that category, please, for 16. Okay. Solid Snake is given about a year left to live when his former commanding officer approaches him with one final mission to terminate Liquid Ocelot. Oh. Come on. Not this crap again. There we go. Corey? Is Metal Gear Solid Liquid Snake. Uh, he, 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 said, he said part of the answer. I, 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 was, I, was, I was going to accept it. Uh, Better Gear Solid 4 specifically is acceptable. Corey, go ahead, yes. please. Didn't know that I almost gave the wrong answer there, Andrew. Let's close that out for 2000. Yeah, you're close here. To complete the category in MVG Productions for 2000. Dance like the king of pop, you can in this game for various systems and featuring crew, duo, and crew modes available. Damn it. What is Corey. Let's Dance? No. Oh, that's not it. Justin? Was Michael Jackson the experience? Correct. Yeah. Oh. 
that forgot could go, there were two different versions. Damn it. That, that concludes the MPG Productions category. I want to thank Mr. Scrux here for thinking up that category. Madden, well done, sir. Thank you. Okay, Justin, you have, you have control, so go ahead and choose another category or not, please. Let's go back to do some more time traveling for 800. Okay, going back to that category. Edward Richtofen, Tank Dempsey, Nikolai Blinsky, and Tako traveled from 1945 to 1963 in a World War II German theater using a teleporter overcharged with a Wunder Wunderwaffe DG-2, a fictional weapon. Corey. I'm taking guess and see what was Gears of Warfare? No. All right. Justin or Chris? What is Call of Duty Black Ops 1? Okay. Yep, yep, that, that's right. Call of Duty Black Ops. Go, go ahead, Justin. All right, time travel for 12. Answer! <laughs> oh. The Daily Double. Justin, you have 4,600. You lead Chris by 4,200. How much you want to wager? 400. Wimp. <laughs> hey, 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 you, 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 you know, the minimum you can wager is five bucks. But, but you're going to wager 400. That's fine. For $400 in the category of time travel, here is your daily double. Eggman sends Sonic and his friends back in time. Several main characters meet up with their past selves to get through the remains of older games' stages. What is Sonic Generations? Correct. Yeah. All right, Justin. You're at 5,000. You still have control. Go ahead. Time to travel for 1,600. Okay. Okay. Raiden, uh, Raiden, about to be killed by Shao, Shao Kahn, casts a last minute spell on his menstrual amulet, contact, contacting his past self with the vague message he must win in this game. Uh, uh, damn it. There we go. Corey. What is Mortal Kombat 9? I, 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 I'll accept that. But yeah, just Mortal Kombat. But, but that's correct. And once more, you're out of the hole, Corey. Let's hope, <sighs> let's, let's hope you stay out of the hole this time. I hope Go so. Ahead, Corey. Go ahead. Uh, time travel 2. Okay, complete that category. Thank you. Okay. Sora, Donald, and Goofy travel to a past time period when Disney Castle is being built and stop Black Pete and his past version from taking the cornerstone of light in what this game. Kakari. What is Kingdom Hearts? Damn it. More specific. What is Kingdom Hearts 2? Yes, that's correct. And Kari. Please, please, please wait till I complete. Please wait till I completed. Wait, please wait till I completed the the career scene before buzzing. Right, I think that was probably an auto buzz by accident. Somehow went through. That happens here. I can please time travel here. Go on, go ahead. Uh, let's see here. Interactive uh, games for two. Okay. Uh, for four, for we wait, 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 uh, wait for for two thousand. You said yes, sir. Okay, this 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 was a tricky one when I, but I, but this is true. For two thousand interactive games, this is one of the main games of a nineteen ninety three U.S. <gasps> Senate committee hearing on violent video games. Keep five teenage girls alive while eliminate enemies. 
try that again. This is one of the main schemes of a 1993 U.S. Senate committee hearing on violent video games, keeping five teenage girls alive while eliminating enemies with various traps. Ring. What is that trap? Uh. That is correct. <laughs> and, and, and folks, that, that, it is true. Uh, C-SPAN.org C-SPAN, they, they, they have something, you know, this, this was one of the major games, and I've seen it. It is ugly. Yeah, and, thank it, you jumped and, on and, them for no reason. Yeah, yeah. Uh, de de definitely rated, I would definitely rate it M for mature, because, well, you understand that one for sure. Definitely. Uh, go, go, yes, go, go ahead, Corey. Just going to say, leave my two cents on it. Bob Keeshan was a pig. Uh, interactive Games for 16. Okay. In this game, you are are a daring man trying to rescue your wife who has re disappeared thanks to Mordok. Save the princess before the death ring is put on her finger. Correct response. What is Dragon's Lair 2? Time Warp. And it, it, it is an interactive game. Uh, it's a good one, too. Corey, go ahead. Let's try 1,200 interactive games. Okay. Want to beat up monsters? You can with the help of Zordon in this Sega CD game. Come on, dang it. There we go. Dropping frames here. It's not letting me. Brandon. Thank you. Car Corey? What is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? Yep, that's right. And you, you know, you're, you're in the lead there, Corey, so go ahead. I would have killed myself if I hadn't gotten that. They just celebrated 25 years. I know, I know. It's a good series. Yep, still entertaining kids to this day. Okay, Corey. Continue you, go the ahead. category, Mr. Sinclair, for 800. Okay. You are Starfleet Cadet Quaylen Furlong, trying to prevent his father's death at Wolf 359 with Q helping out. Anyone? Great response. What is Star Trek Borg? Close it out for more. Okay. This game is based on the hit AMC show dealing with zombies in Atlanta, Georgia. Come on. Here we go. Damn it. Justin. What is The Walking Dead? That's correct. Oh, that's it. I freaking hate that buzzer. <laughs> All right, that concludes interactive games. Uh, go ahead, Justin. You're second place. Go ahead, choose another category to mount. Hmm. Hmm. Let's take a look at the best reviewed Wii U games. Four hundred. Okay, here. Let, let, let me get that page here. Uh, here we are. Okay, for 400 best review Wii U games by Metacritic. Here. This classic Wii U game features various characters, including Mario and Sonic, battling it out to see who is the best of the best. I'm ringing. Damn it. Corey? What does Mario and Sonic get the Olympic Games? No. What? Justin. Why is my own song at the London 2012 Olympic Games? No. Not ch I'm not chasing it. Sorry. Probably so you won. Uh, well, there is something. You know, Marlon said, you know, you know, battling on something, but I was looking for this one. 
What is Super Smash Brothers? Damn it! Bal- bal- I don't know ba- why you didn't ba- get that. Uh, Balling out, you know, it, you know, oh. you, you compete, but it, it's a battle here. That, that's oh, why okay. about that part. So uh, go ahead, uh, uh, Justin. Eight hundred plus. Okay. This game is set on the surface of the planet PF. Try again. This game is set on the surface of the planet PNF four hundred four. The setting of the two previous games. Five areas of PF PNF four hundred four are accessible for the player to explore. Nothing. I'm past. Corey? What is Pikmin? More specific. What is Pikmin 2? Judge? <sighs> Justin or Chris? What is Pikmin 3? Oh, one off. Damn. Go ahead, Justin. Best reviewed Wii U games, 1200. Okay. One of the best series of superheroes, including Spider Man, Captain America, and Wolverine, amongst others, shrunk down to small pieces in this game. Mm. Not touching that. Me neither. Me neither. Me neither. Response, what is Lego Marvel Super Heroes? Oh, dang it. Oh, I think I know what friend that has that. Go ahead, Justin. 1600 best reviewed video games. Okay. After the failure to invade Peach's Castle, Bowser and Koopalings reinvade the castle this time without abducting Mario due to him not being present in this game. What is that? Justin? What is new Super Luigi U? There's such a game. Uh I am going to accept that. You, I was looking for Super Luigi U. You added one more word. Uh, accept it. Go ahead, Justin. Best, best, best reviewed Wii U games. Okay, for 2000. This puzzle game lets you guide a guide. Try that again. This puzzle game lets you guide a cube to isometric maze-like levels towards the goal. Levels are made up of platforms and blocks played from the top down. Oh, man, I'm touching that. Correct response, what is edge? Edge. That concludes... That concludes the best. That concludes the best reviewed Wii U cat Wii U games. Here we're down to two categories. Justin, go ahead. Six generation video games for four hundred. Okay. This series of games from two thousand one to two thousand three include a game where you can play the third video game in the NES series. Just watch up, but just watch up for Bowser and his Koopa kids. Oh, figure that out. Not coming. Correct response. What is Super Mario Advance? Oh, go ahead, Justin. Answer. <laughs> the second day of double in the round. Justin, you are still in first place. You now lead Corey by sixteen hundred. How much you want to wager? All or nothing. Let's go. All in. A true daily double. 
and the category of sixth generation video games. Good luck. Here is your clue. The player starts a circuit race driving a uniquely styled Acura Integra Type R. It is the seventh game in this racing series. Damn Justin? Uh, I got nothing. I think I might know it, Andrew, since he said he doesn't know it. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Uh, go ahead. What, what, what do you think it is? Need for Speed. Need for Speed Underground 2, specifically. Well, Justin, you, you took a gamble, and I like that. You're down to nothing, but still tats here. So there's still time for you to catch up here. So go ahead, choose the category. Choose, the, choose an amount and the category. Six race in the games for 1,200. Okay. This 2004 game finds Acme agent Cole Gannon maneuvering through nine stages trying to bring this crimson crime leader to justice. Anyone? I know it's a Carmen San Diego franchise game, but I can't think of the title. That been that would been enough. Correct response oh, was Carmen San Diego, the secret of the stolen drums. I would have just set the Carmen San Diego alone. Oh, oof. Go ahead, Justin. Sixteen uh, no. Six hundred. Six hundred of video games. Okay. A 2003 sci-fi series inspired this game. The player plays as Commander Adama in the different missions against Cylon ships during the first Cylon War. Ringing. Thank you. Cor Corey. What is Battlestar Galactica? Correct. Go ahead. Close it out, please, sir. Okay. This silly racing game stars Bugs Bunny, Daffy Duck, and Wiley Coyote, Coyote, amongst other others, gain to the goal in various stages of Out Amongst the Stars. Ring in. Corey. What is Looney Tunes racing? Judge? I'm sorry. All right, that's fine. Justin or Chris? Not a chance. I don't think I can chance that. You were close, Corey. You, you forgot one word. The correct response was Looney Tunes Space Race. Oh, that's fine. I'm not worried. Uh, cats right, and dogs for four. Okay, we're down to one category. It's cats and dogs to number 400. Okay. This fat orange cat has video games subtitled Threat of the Space Lasagna, The Search for Pookie, and Caught in the Act, amongst others. Bring it. Oh. Justin. Who is Garfield? God, was... Correct. That, that was close. Go, go ahead, Justin. 800 cats and dogs. Okay. This famous beagle who has video games subtitles Find Ace, Silly Sports Spectacular, and Grand Adventure has an owner who can't kick a ball held by a girl. Buzz then. Thank you. Corey. What is Snoopy? Yep. Continue the category. Uh, 1200, please. Okay. Oh, jeez. Who held a rod and reel waiting for Froggy to, co to come back to him was helped by Amy and Cream in Sonic Heroes. 
He was retired in 2012. Justin? Who is Big the Cat? Correct. <laughs> Go ahead, Justin. Uh, Cats and Dogs, 1600. <clears throat> okay. Okay. The main character of this game for the PS2, a happy-go-lucky mutt, on a mission to rescue the girl dog of his dreams. Daisy was named this in a dog's life. Cousin. Corey. What's Pep Rap as the rapper? No. Let's see. Justin or Chris? Nope. Not Jake. Chris Bonds. Who is Jake? Close enough uh, for two. Okay. I'm. 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 I'm going to check that. Check that last one here. I'm not sure. It might be Parappa. Uh, okay. For two thousand. Apollo, Hercules, and Ares are the three characters you can choose in this NES series created by Active Enterprises for three anthropomorphic animals. Quick response, who are the Cheetah Man? Well... That includes Double Jeopardy. We have some interesting scores here. Chris still in third place with 400. Justice in second place with 1,600. Corey is in lead with 3,800. Time now for Final Jeopardy. Here is tonight's Final Jeopardy category. It is eSports. Gentlemen, think about your... Think about what you're going to wait here. In the meantime, we're going to take a commercial break, and we'll be right back with Final Jeopardy. Stay tuned. Welcome back. Our contestants have, have pin me their wagers. In the category of eSports. Gentlemen, in a moment, I'm going to give you the clue. You will then have 30 seconds to PM me your response. Please make sure it is in the form of a question. Here is your clue for tonight. In 2016, University of Texas at Arlington and Arizona State were the final two teams who played, it, who played this Five on five team game featuring 80 heroes and 15 maps to play on. Gentlemen, you have 30 seconds. Good luck. One, two, two, one more. Okay. <laughs> uh, I am uh, all, 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 all right. Uh, 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 very funny. Okay, time is up. We'll start with Chris. You have four dollars. What is your response? Why what is it? I, I never <laughs> see that theory. Well, I, I respect that answer. Of course, that is wrong. How much did you wager? Nothing. Zero. You made up 400. Justin, you're next. You have 1600. What did you respond? What is NCAA football? Close, but not quite. How much did you wager? 1600 uh, we're down to nothing. Corey? Yes. Yeah, unless, unless, unless you did a Cliff Cleveland, Cliff Cleveland mm -hmm. uh, you, you're going to win here. Right. You have 3800 What is the response? 
I said, what is, says, I, don't I don't know, know and I, I want to get it. <laughs> Very funny. The correct response here in this case is, what is Heroes of the Storm? That's what it is. Okay. How much do you wager? 100. You're down 3,700. Corey, congratulations. You win again. You win a two team total of $9,700. Congratulations, Corey. Thank you. Well, Corey, Corey you're, you're now only the second player to have won two games. Well yep. done. And if you win the next game, you automatically advance into the turn of champions. Folks, we have three games remaining before we find out who advances to the turn of champions. Will Mr. Lawrence be our first automatic finalist? By now, you'll have to tune in next time. That's, to, that's all for tonight's episode of Video Game Jeopardy. I want to thank everyone here for coming here tonight. Thank you, Mr. Scruggs. And, and everyone, if you like what you saw, please hit the bell at MPG Productions. Help Mr. Scroggs hit 1,000. Until next time, when we see Corey Lawrence go for his third and final win, this is your host, Andrew Sage Clare. Say goodnight. So long, everybody. This is Brandon Scruggs speaking for Video Game Jeopardy. A traveling booth production in association with MVG Productions.